Welcome to my channel. If you did not see my first video here on this channel, I am a third year teacher. I taught kindergarten for two years and now I am in second grade for my third year. In today's video, I'm going to be showing and sharing all about my classroom library. I will also be sharing different things in my library of where things are from, etc. I do want to preface this by saying that I just left school and it's 531. We have a long week ahead. It's a Monday and we have conferences all week. So I am teacher tired today, but let's get into the video. All right. I want to start by saying that my classroom library has always been a struggle for me and I'm always finding myself rearranging it, but I've loved it this year. So I will start by saying my shelves that I've used this year I have loved they are like the cube storages from Target and I absolutely love them so so much more and then for my bulletin board back here that I love so much the paper and the border is from Lakeshore Learning and then the letters themselves with the quote and these posters here are both from Teachers Pay Teachers and I love the addition that they have made to my library. And then my baskets here, they're all white. Um, I do have a missing one. I need to get one more, but they are from Target and I absolutely love them. The kids can get them off the shelves by themselves, even with all the books inside of them. And I love them. They hold a lot of books. My labels I made and then I just attached, I laminated them and attached them with Velcro and they work perfectly. And then for my chapter books, I have book bins for those specifically also from Target but in the dollar section. And with those labels, I also made them myself as well. And I love them, they hold up really well. And the kids can organize and put books back by themselves easily with these labels and I love that. This is my book return. The crate is from Target but you can find these crates literally everywhere and anywhere um, and the kids know after they are done with the book they just return it here. As you can see these are my labels. I got them from TPT again but I kind of edited them a little bit. I use AR and so I kind of just put the AR level, their quiz number, if it's an AR book. And then for books that are not AR, I just re-edit those labels of just that it belongs to our classroom. On the wall, I do have a little decorative piece from Hobby Lobby that I love so much. And then these are the student book bins. They are from Really Good Stuff. They have held up amazing over my three years, including two years of kindergarten, obviously. These labels I made and I just have their student class number on them. That works great. Each student is allowed to have two books that are in their AR level in their book bin at all times. This is by far one of my favorite parts of my classroom. I am absolutely loving it this year. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing parts of our library and a little bit of a closer look at that. I will be sharing more things teaching related in the upcoming videos. So I will be posting um, a new video every Sunday and Wednesday from here on out. That is the plan as of right now. So go ahead and subscribe if you have not already done so. And I will see you on Sunday. Thanks for watching. Bye.